الحمد لله مجيب من دعا وفاتح الباب لعبد قرا إذ قوله أمن يجيب مضطر إذا دعا اللهم أرنا الحق حق وارزقنا اتباع وارنا الباطل باطل وارزقنا اتناب رب شرح لي صدر ويسر لي أمر وحل العقدة من لساني يفقه قولي أما بعد Alhamdulillah, Allah has represented me with another opportunity today to interview Brother Mu'iz. Brother Mu'iz has been suffering for so many years. He's got Sihrul Fashal and he's got Sihrul Sifli. These are one of the wickedest and bad magic. How are you, Brother Mu'iz? Alhamdulillah. Just uh, as he is, as he is, yeah. Alhamdulillah. 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 Yeah. Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. We just we don't need to, to give up. Yes. You course. have to. Uh, we have to fight. Mm. All the ways. Mm. Uh, Alhamdulillah. When did, did your problem start? My problem start uh, when I've been very young. You know, I've been nine till to ten years old. When uh, you know, I got infection in my chest and in my leg also. So I just got in, in hospital, but you know, it wasn't any reason why I got chest infection. I was very healthy, very active, very, you know, very good in the school and everything. And from that time, just, just boom, you know, I got infection and that's it. And the medics, the hospital, they negative. You know, everything in hospital except, you know, my infection, they, they don't know what is the problem. They, they, they doesn't know how, what's the problem, mm. why, you know, how come this uh, infection? Mm. Yeah. And uh, over this, so keep on going to hospital, coming out? Yeah, no, keep going no, to hospital. No. You know, the, the first time I've been for three months and I couldn't work for, couldn't, uh, walk for uh, two years. Mm. And uh, after two, two years, you know, I start walking. Alhamdulillah. And uh, but yeah, yeah, just, uh, you know, go in hospital, come back, go hospital, come back, you know, all, you, all, you, always you, like that. Different problems also with, uh, with the kidneys, with the uh, breathing, uh, infection, with, uh, without any reason, just, uh, you know, everything messed up. Hmm. Your parents don't know what's the problem. The doctors don't know what's the problem. And you, at the same time, at a very, very young age, you've been suffering. Yes, the uh, my parents, they, they never, the, you know, they never understood, you know, that was the problem. How come this this illness or something? You know, they keep asking me, mm. did you injure your leg somewhere or did you do this? Because I've been very active mm. person, yeah. And uh, but you know, uh, until today, you know, I, I keep thinking. If I injured my my leg somewhere, but no, mm. <laughs> never. Yeah, mm. it just happened, and uh, yeah, they 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 always we've been always confused. For how many years been going to hospital in and out? For how long? Uh, Alhamdulillah, you know I've been going now. I'm forty two. I'm going for forty three years old, and uh, till now, you still going to hospital? Still. still yeah, sometime going. For checkups, but they don't know yeah, what's yeah, the yeah, problem. Yeah. No, the, when I go there, you know, with the blood test and uh, this and that, nothing All wrong. Clean, everything is, is perfect. Clean. Yeah, results, everything uh, is clean. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah. Now, in Albania, when you, you, when you go to the hospital and come back, go to the hospital and come back, did, did, what solution? Because... You don't have any another solution now. You go into hospital and the problem still exists. Yeah. What happened then? Uh, actually, in Albania, you know, I used to go for this for the same thing. You know, just get infection mm. for no reason. Just get infection, go there, stay in hospital for a few days, ten days, two weeks, and come out and uh, get some antibiotics, become better, come out after a year, two years, back again, back outside. You know. Yeah. So it's always it's like the that. nine years old while you were nine years old. Nine years old. old. Yeah. When did you know? <clears throat> or after the nine years? Tell, tell me about the experience after. Well, the experience, uh, you know, till I, I under, understood I have something, mm. you know, I always I knew something is, is wrong. In the back of me. your mind. Yes. Because, you know, it's not just uh, go hospital and come back from hospital, but even. You know, when I, I try to do any job or, you know, I've been, as I told you, I've been an active person. Mm. You know, I try to do any business or something. I always felt, 
Always, mm. always, never ever, you know, I, I've seen any progress or something in your business. So I always, I knew something is not wrong, right. it's not right. Mm -hmm. Because, you know, it, it doesn't work like that. Mm. You know, if if you work, you have to to, to get the, the reward back. Absolutely. Yes. But uh, no, it never happened. You said nine years. You, the problem started nine yes. years. Yes. Yes. What happened after nine years? Ten years, eleven years. How, your life uh, pattern. No, my life changed for bad. Mm -hmm. Actually, no, no, for good. Mm -hmm. You know, uh, I had infection. The infection was uh, the 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 main problem on me. Infection, but, the legs and the yeah, 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 and uh, in even in kidneys. Mm, subhanallah. Also, yeah, and and in chest. Many times, and uh, and uh, I had a problem with the kidneys many times, which you know, I can get the I can, well, can, you can young. start the pain. Yes, it, it, it can start the pain. And How it, old are you when you get the kidney pains? And uh, for the first time, I've been uh, maybe twelve years old. Mm, yeah, years something old. like that. The first time when I got the pain in in the kidney, mm. that was that bad, uh, which uh, you know. I never experienced in my life. Mm, subhanallah. Yeah. Subhanallah. I never ex experienced in my life. That mm. was first time. And after, you know, it carried on with that. I remember you told time me after time. at your own property, your own house. Yes. You used to fight parents, your brother, kettles, they used to die for no reason. Tell me about this. Uh, actually, in our house, you know. And how old were you then? Yeah. Actually, in our house, you know, after I I experienced the first time the hospital, mm. nine years old, you know, we we've been in and out in hospital, and after that we we come back home, you know, it starts fighting. And uh, I you, never you and uh, who's who started fighting? Well, start fighting, you know, the mother, father, and brothers, and you know, we never get peace. Mm, in the no house even from outside we we can have a uh, uh, troubles always mm. even from from our relatives we can have the trouble always they never stops mm. it never stops but what uh, you know i never mentioned in my life with anyone the which i noticed in that time which uh, till before I, I come to england you know was because uh, i've seen uh, my dad he wasn't same anymore with me. This is the first time I'm, I'm mentioning here. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. He never, never same any, anymore with me. And how old were you then? Uh, I was, you know, from nine years old till uh, 33 years old, you know. He wasn't same. He, he wasn't same, you know. I'm not saying he, he doesn't love me or he doesn't love me before, but he was a bit, a bit like, like, if I can say, you know, a cold person Hard. towards me. Yeah. Yes. No same anymore. Different with my brother. Mm. Yeah. And uh, I never know. I never knew what's, you what's, don't the, know problem. what's the problem. Yeah. No, I, I never knew. But you just find actually. him cold. Just, uh, you just find him cold with me. Mm. And uh, sometimes, you know, he, he beats me because uh, as I thought, I've been a bit uh, actually yeah, yeah, yeah. naughty. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. In a young age, and uh, but he just beat me, just just, uh, just random beat. Just yeah 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 yeah. Just yes, never know. never try to argue with me or or to teach me why you did this. Don't do this. No mm. no no no. His shit way. He will uh, just go and lash on you. Yeah yeah yeah. He, he will mm. slap me. Mm. Yeah, which is uh, not been before. So the argument in the, at home. Him fighting you with your mom, uh, you fighting with your brothers, or you never thought of anything. Well, it always looks strange, brother Yahya. Mm. It looks strange on you in your mm. family, mm. but uh, no peace we, at home. No peace at home. But we had fifty years communism in in Albania, mm. and all knowledge about the, these things was, um, if I can say, limited. Uh, Nearly zero. Right. Nearly zero. There's no knowledge about No it. knowledge. 
Mm. No knowledge. Because obviously About if you... About and evil eye. Oh yeah, we just, uh, you know, the, like uh, when somebody mentions a seher or evil eye or something, you know, it looks like it's all story. You know? mm. Yeah, it's all old story. Fairytale. Yeah, yeah, it's all story. Mm. Yeah, or when somebody telling, for example, uh, we think uh, he has any or she has any seher, for some people, for example. Mm. We used to see like, no me, but the, the, my dad and mom and even other people, you know, used to see the, the, these things strange, you know. Mm. Yeah. Tell me about the kettles. You told me that they, they keep on dying. Every... Oh, oh, yeah, we had uh, cats, we had uh, dogs, you know, they, they, they keep, they, they're just dying. Mm. Yeah. And the goat yeah. and sheep. Yes, oh, yeah. And the, uh, that was the, the main problem. The never we had because I used to live we live in village till mm. today, mm. and uh, we used to have cow and uh, horses and uh, beef and uh, sheep and you know many of them. Yeah, alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah, and they, they they just keep dying, just keep dying. Even till today, the 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 problem starts it is uh, uh, still going on. They keep dying yeah, for yeah, no yeah, reason. No, for for no reason. Yeah, for not is, the, the is it last every day or every year. No, or? every every year because it can't happen every day. Yeah, because yeah. if if it's happen every day, we they will we'll, finish. Yeah, yes. we'll finish. But actually, for example, one year, one a year at least, one cow a year will die. The last one has been uh, one year ago. The last one. A cow dies. Yes, the cow for dies. Absolutely no. Absolutely reason. no reason. No disease. No nothing. No disease, no nothing. Just it start uh, no eating, no drinking, and for a few days gone. Hmm. Yeah, even till today, the, the ships, they just die. We wake up in the morning, we go out to feed them or something. We just see them dead. Dead. Yeah, hmm. no reason. No reason. Yeah. The sihr is still active. Well, I think so. Yeah, hmm. the sihr is still active. Yeah. May Allah make it easy for you. I mean, Ya Rabbi Allah. Tell me about after that. What about your marriage? I, th- I think you told me about you got married and then got divorced and uh, uh, the proposal day. There was. Yeah. yeah. Tell me all about this. <coughs> actually, actually, this. Uh, <laughs> uh, I, I want to say this terrible story started yeah, when I when I become twenty years. Mm-hmm. Or let's say 22 years, because you know my my dad. You know after that, after I've been 20, 22 years, you know it, it becomes a little bit soft with me. Mm-hmm. No aggressive as always he, he because, was, yeah. yeah. But when he become uh, soft with me, my mom starts. She starts with me. Don't become aggressive. Yeah, she become aggressive, but she go, she become more bad than my dad. Mm. Yeah, and it uh, a nightmare or nightmare. Mm. That was a nightmare. And uh, you know, they asked me to to get engaged with a uh, with any girl. You know, we alhamdulillah. The we, girl of your choice of their choice. Uh, well, they they asked me to see her, for example. But you know, at the end of the day, they they want their choice mm. to go on. And uh, I just you know. I say, you know, I said several times no because, uh, you know, I just feel I doesn't want. Mm. I doesn't want. Yeah, you don't want it. You don't yeah, know to why. get engaged or I didn't know why or to get married. But uh, you know, after two three years, I become twenty three, twenty four years, so I had to go no choice. My mom become very very aggressive, mm. so I had to go to see, and I can see the girl. Nothing wrong with that, you know. I just I can't. I doesn't feel the. I want to get married, mm, you know, to the woman. And yeah, and the main problem was when when I go to to meet, for example, the girl. We go to see, yeah. We just to see fa- family, their their family and our family. My dad, my mom, and me, and my sister, sometime. And they are the family, and we go. We see each other, and that's it. But. When I when I go to to see the girl, you know, I f- I feel that pressure, which no one can imagine. You yourself. Yes, myself, 
you know, you I feel the pressure? The, the pressure was very tight. The, my chest, it goes very, very, very tight. Like been, someone wants to break it. Yes, yes, yes. Even my throat, like, you know, when if you put the somebody else, you know, the, the hands in your in your throat, mm. you know, it very, even I can't breathe. Subhanallah. Sometimes, yeah, just drink water. Just to go and see the proposal. Just to go to see the proposal. No mm. more, but at least to go. To go there. Mm. And uh, I couldn't say yes. Wasn't was very 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 hard, extremely hard to say yes. To say yes. And, and what, what happened then? Oh, uh, in uh, in age twenty eight years old, you know, I had no choice from my mom. So so every time you go for proposal, you can't even utter no a word and say no, yes. No, yeah. no, I always I can say no. Yeah. And they asked me why she's nice, she's beautiful, and this and that. I say, I just, I don't know, but I can't say yes. Mm. Yeah. And uh, when I, I've been 20 years old, 28 years old, uh, I had no choice. You know, I like you or no, I had to, to, to engage with the. Uh, with the one did you went to did you go to see her or did you we go to see her i said no to same? my i said no to my parents my mom bec becomes mad mm -hmm. she goes mad and uh, and i was thinking just to get out from a house to go somewhere and i tried in that time to go abroad two three times but even when i tried to go abroad it doesn't work it doesn't work which I had no choice. Mm. Yeah, because I, d I wanted to, to get out from my house. Mm. You know, it become a nightmare, mm. as you said before. Yeah. And, uh, okay, I said, yes, no choice for me anymore. I said, yes, you know, we go engaged with a, with a girl. And I was feeling, you know, my the, the, the sky, the piece of sky is, is, is coming to my, to my head, like mm. very, very heavy thing. And, uh, the chest and everything everything is is very very hard to explain you mm. know properly mm. and after three four months we we did separated. yeah we separated you never consummated the marriage no 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 we never consummated the marriage subhanallah yes and uh, after uh, four years i go engaged again again had no choice it, from my mom Pressure. Yeah, yeah. A pressure you can't imagine, brother. Yeah, 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 yeah. You can't. Right. Now, for, for you going through all this, what went into your mind? What did you decide to do? Did you Have you not ever thought of looking for help? Uh, in Albania, you can uh, I've been looking for help. Tell me about it. Yeah. Well, I, I always, I thought something is going on because, you know, I even feel like, Blocked like you are in chain. Yeah, locked up. Yeah, locked up. And uh, I tried. I've been to to Hafizis, you know, sometime. Mm. The in Albania it's been traditional to, to write a piece of paper, some mm. uh, duas yeah. from Talasa. Quran, and yeah, yeah and Sihru you know, Talasa. just mm. wear wear in in your neck. Mm. And uh, but you know I, i've seen so many people that they go help from them because from, the, from this guy yeah because oh, they've been some hafizis you know the the different good, different yeah, yeah the good people actually and uh, no not all of them yeah and they they go help you know they sort the the problems out and everything but not for me it doesn't work yeah tell me what happened and uh, i tried many many of them mm -hmm. You know, and after that, you know, somebody told me for uh, a woman, what? which he does, she, it doesn't look right on me. Mm -hmm. Tell us, tell, tell me. But uh, I was thinking, let's go to see her at least. Mm. And I if I see anything wrong, just get rid of her, get out. But probably I'm going to find any help. Okay, and I goes there, I book appointment, and she told me, by my uh, seeing my name, she told me to get a lock next time with me. Mm -hmm. The new lock. Which I goes, I bought the new lock in market place. 
I goes home after some days. I goes down to in, because it was in the, in city, and uh, I goes to see her. She said, she asked me for a lock. I said, there you go, the keys, three keys inside, and uh, she become like I don't know, like sick or like moving her head and things like looks like talk is talking to someone. Mm. Yeah, it looks like that, but you can I didn't see anyone. Yeah. Anyway. And after that, you know, she, she tried talking to the gin. Uh, yeah, yes. Now I un- I know now. Yeah. But in that time, you know, and after she opened the lock and she 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 tell me after through this lock, when the road crossing T junction. Yeah. Okay, I did, I did that, and nothing changed. Nothing mm. changed. Yeah. Even probably I can say it, it, it goes more hard. Yeah, than she it did. Was. She did more sehr on. Yeah, so sehr on padlocks. And I, rem- uh, I remember yeah. you told me you went to a guy, you and your dad, and your brother, I think, and then the guy just straight away picked you up. All right. Yeah. Um, no, I've, no, I've not been with my dad. Oh, you alone? In, yeah, I've been my alone. Yeah. Tell you me know, about. You know, this uh, this man was in capital city. All right. Tell me about it, please. Yeah. Uh, actually, you know, many people they 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 got cured from this from, guy. From this guy, it looks his name was Ali, mm. you know, which is Muslim name and beautiful mm. name, mm. and he was Muslim, right? Yeah, and uh, you, you know, I can see the queue, very 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 long queue. Yeah, of people. Yeah, and he just come out and he looks at the name because somebody one hour before he comes out you know he took our names he write it down our names somebody which uh, it stays with him and when he came uh, this person go on other side this person you you come you have to stay this person and when he says to you know he mentioned my name he says you have to stay I said, okay, you know, I was thinking, Alhamdulillah, inshallah, and he, he's going to be, and yeah, he's going to solve your problem. He's going to solve my problem. Yeah. And uh, when uh, I go to see him alone, he opened the Quran, he just, you know, tried to, <laughs> he's very funny, you know, they just try to make any dua or something, open the Quran. He said, you doesn't have anything. You don't. Yeah, just find a good girl or this and that and just get married. You don't have anything. He said to me, just uh, light a candle and just put it there. Oh. Okay, I did. <laughs> and, uh, but I've been two times to him because he told me, come the next come time. Back, and yeah. yeah, now, you know, he distar- dis- discharged me after mm. second time. But, you know, I wasn't the same and before. Actually, you know, I have to tell the truth. Mm. You know, I was more calm after when after going. Yeah, to after I've been to him, you know, the the chest is still tight, but not uh, the same as before. Mm. Yeah, was a bit different, but nothing works uh, worked anyway mm-hmm. because of the so same. yeah yeah so nothing everything was was the same except that what I told you. Mm. That's how it is, you know, sihir. you cannot solve sihir with the sihir. Yeah, no, no. It's only going to come down maybe one or two weeks and then poof. Yes, yes, again, yeah. Like yeah, a, yeah, 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 yeah. Like a volcano. The yes. only way forward is yeah. Quran. And no All writing way. of papers. No, 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 no. It doesn't no, work. No, yeah. no, no. These old people are just wasting their time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. How did you discover that you have a problem? Because After, I remember you to be when you came here, you, you told me that you've been going to hospital and hospital. Yes, you can't yeah. sleep. Tell yeah, us all about yeah, this. Yeah, yeah. You know, uh, I came to to England after eight months. I divorced with my second wife. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I divorced with her. You know, I just felt you know I have to go out from from these troubles. Mm. Yeah, I have to go out. I can't. I couldn't stay anymore. You yeah. know, I was desperate to go out somewhere. Mm. And uh, I decided, Alhamdulillah, you know, Allah, you know, he made it easy for me to mm. come to come here. Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. And, uh, but the, the, the test, 
Alhamdulillah, the test from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, it just starts when I come here. Mm. That just was proper test. <laughs> yeah. Tell me about it. Uh, I came the, the first 10 months, uh, I've not been working except for 15 days. During the 10 months. I've been eight months uh, in Preston. And one month I'd go to my cousin in London. When I was in London, I was without any work, without any money, without anything. <laughs> Alhamdulillah. And uh, it just, I've been to the hospital for my kidney, which that has been the craziness pain I ever see. Mm, yes. I just, I, I even start to vomit and to go unconsciousness sometime. And, you know, very, very in bad condition. But anyway, that passed also, alhamdulillah. And uh, after 10 months, I, I just found it a job. Alhamdulillah. I've been working for three months and after that. And that three months with uh, many, many problems. Yeah. Tell me these pro about this problem. Uh, the, the problem was uh, because every time I, uh, I find a job, for example, somebody would be a problem for me. Yeah, in that time was a manager. He will dislike you. He will dislike me. He will give me a trouble. He will try offend me sometime and this and that. And, and the, was, the workers will like you or dislike you? Well, with the workers, a bit different. Mm. But yes. But, but always the, somebody the, dislike you. Yes, yes, yes. Somebody will dislike me, you this know. Is in, yes, mm. very, very badly, you mm. know. And, uh, you know, the last. When I, the last uh, arg argument which I had with him, you know. That's the manager. Uh, yeah, with the, man no, with the manager there in that time, you know, we just, we nearly been fighting because he's, he's trying to offend me for no reason. And he, was, uh, he wants to bully you. Yes. And, you know, I, you know, I said, this, this happened. Well, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, just, I want to stop the job working with here. I can't work anymore with him. Mm. Yeah. This is the attributes of Sihr al Yeah. Uh, and somebody uh, or people will just dislike you. Yes. For no reason. Yes. Mm. And after that, I left the job. I stopped the working there. I left the job, you know, and I've been uh, a month at home without any work. And, but I had at least some money to, to pay rent and to, to eat food and this and that. Yeah, Alhamdulillah. And after that, I found it a job in Manchester, in a um, big city. And uh, I've been there for three years. That has been, that has been the, still a craziness test. Oh, right. Yeah. Tell me about it. Never, never succeed. Brother Yahya. Mm. Never, ever succeed. I tried to, to, Get to do... Get sucked in the world. Going to work, uh, because at that time, we, me and my friend, we had an uh, old car wash, you know, together. Mm. But we had never been busy. We struggled to pay rent. We struggled to pay a rent for, for a car wash, a rent for home. We struggled to have money for, for food. We struggled in every way. And that has been for three years. Mm. But the, the last year, during the last year, you know, I was just, I was looking at the Facebook and I saw somebody reading, reciting Quran in somebody else. That has been the first time and, the, you know, Alhamdulillah, I got, I got happy because I got happy because that was in London when I saw in Facebook, mm. you know, the number is uh, English number. So I contact them, you know, after a few days so. They, they've been in London. And uh, I just book a point, man, to go there and... Uh, this is after these three years now. So yeah, the last problem. year of three years. Yeah. yeah, probably the last six months. So tell before. me about the problems. The problems you've been facing. That you have a car wash, but there is no... No body. busy, no work, uh, very people, hard to survive with, the with people, that money. The people dislike you. Uh, people, people dislike me. Everywhere you yeah, go. Yeah, yeah, every, in every way. 
you go yeah in every way i go for example the we just dislike yeah you. dislike mm. offending and if this you go and to that. any work we get sucked all yes the yes 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 mm. which is mm. it, it happened mm. it happened many times and the the first time when i you know book the appointment to go for the rookie yeah, i, and I never go. never been before that for the rukia which i never knew how it works what that works and this and that i goes there you know i fulfill a form and everything and uh, i paid some money also and i goes inside of the room you know when he starts reading quran it you know i i become like sleeping and uh, my chest tight and in my bellies, like you know, when somebody's swimming, yes, you feel. He, he, I feel like that, and which he wants to come out also. Mm. So, for forty minutes or forty-five minutes, so I notice. I said, "Yes, this is something going on." And I asked the Raki. He said, uh, "Probably he's been any seher or any gym position or this and that." But he said, "Definitely is something." Yes. Yeah. yeah, because it was first time, mm. and uh, he gave me some some honey, which he he recite surah and rukia. He did he did rukia on the on the honey, and he said just get this honey, and inshallah you will get better. Yeah, get better and be clean and things. And uh, but after that, you know, I keep going to to the other Rockies, you know, because I was thinking the, he's more stronger or more, mm. yeah. Yeah, well, but that's well, that's wrong. You should have just. It's better to stick. Yes, with one person. yes, but still, I was I was new in the experience. Yeah, yeah. So Alhamdulillah. <laughs> Alhamdulillah. Yeah. May Allah make it easy for you. I mean, yeah, and may Allah remove Amin. the difficulty you're going through, and may Allah destroy the sihr yourself. I mean, especially you're Amin. going through. And it was nice to have you in the podcast. Nice, nice to talk yeah. to you, brother Yahya. Yeah, and I ask the viewers, all of them, to make dua for you. Oh, Jazakallah, uh, thank you. May Allah relieve thank you, you from this distress. Amin, Ya Rabbil yeah. it's, it's, Amin. Imagine the, from nine years old until now, till now. 42. For, 43 nearly. 43, yes. It should be around 30 something years. Yeah. Something 33 or 30, 34 years, 34 years, yeah, 34 yeah. years of suffering. Yes, yeah, it's absolutely uh, it's a test uh, because Allah says in the Quran, You cannot say you believe, you not be tested. That is true. Alhamdulillah, yeah. you've been patient, inshallah, be patient, and you'll be become you'll become victorious. Yeah, alhamdulillah, yeah, inshallah. Victorious. <clears throat> yeah. What advice can you give to uh, those? who have similar problem, yeah. who jumping from one raqi to another raqi, well, sheikh to another sheikh. Yes. Uh, my advice is uh, to them not to give up and to fix the, themselves to the one raqi, mm -hmm. which they have to see is that proper or not. And if that proper, for example, uh, I don't want the, to give names. The, yeah. To give names, but like like you, for example, mm -hmm. yeah. So uh, to fix themselves, the, you know, to find a person and not to jump to, to, to many people. Way. It's no, it's no good. You're going, you're not going to solve a problem Absolutely. anyway. Yeah. yeah, just to, to focus on him and uh, keep seeing him regularly. Mm -hmm. Yes, mm -hmm. and uh, yeah, be patient. Don't give up. Don't stop rukia. Because uh, many people, they, you know, they get upset and uh, frustrated and bored and this and that. And, you know, I'm tired of this. So I'm tired of... No, no, no. That is a test from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Of course. Yeah. Of course. And Allah give you that test. You have to pass that. Mm, absolutely. Yeah. True. And Allah also That's, says in the Quran. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala give you that. You have to pass that. Definitely. 100%. Mm. Have to do that. So don't give up. Allah says Make Rukia in home, uh, read Quran in home, you, you know, which is uh, very lucky for them, which they, they can read in Arabic. For example, I can't read in Arabic. Yeah, you have to read in your own language. Yes, I have to read in my language. You know, they, they doesn't know their value, you know, because they, they can there's, read in Arabic. There's a lot of people in your situation, Brother Maurice. Yeah. A lot of people. A lot of people. Yes. 
what I will finish with is Allah says in the Quran, Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim, Inna Allah la yugayyiru ma biqoomin hatta yugayyiru ma biqoomin. Allah will never change the condition of the people until the people, they change themselves. Now for, you, for the person to get better, Chira. he has to change his condition. Yes, very he true. He has to look around. Yes. What is he doing which yes. is not right? Yes. And then rectify and then Allah yes. Actually, will help him. Yeah, he's here in this uh, calamity, if I can say, mm. you know, is one side is good. Because you get tested from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, you get in re rewards. Absolutely, at the same time. And at the same time, for example, uh, I never prayed five times a day, I'm telling the truth. You mm. know, I've been regular going to, to Friday, always. Mm. Till since young. Yeah, since yeah. you were young, yeah. Since I've been young. Yeah. But never five. But you when know, you I, discovered... I, used to pray, I used to pray, for example, uh, Isha sometime, mm. Fajr sometime, because I used to love Islam, mm. but never been praying regularly. Mm. So when I discovered this, I start praying five times a day, which, uh, which, you know, if he was if in I, if he, I, he, if he I stop now, uh, you know, it, it's better for me to to, to to go to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala because you can't, you know, I, I don't know what to say, but this yeah. is a, a life for me. It's a breathing. It's, it's a guidance. Allah yeah. has guided you through this, through, yes. difficult, through this calamity. Yeah. Because uh, you've been, like you said, praying one day, praying yeah. there and there. But after discovering your yeah. core problem, you took the guidance seriously. Yes. But there are some people who never take that seriously. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Ask Allah to make it easy for you Amen. and for Amen. all those Amen. who are suffering. Amen. 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 Amen.